Welcome to A2S Learning. In this video, we will study about double circulation. If you have not watched my previous video on the structure of the heart, please do watch that video and also kindly like and subscribe to my channel. Now, let us study about double circulation. Humans have a closed circulatory system in which blood pumped by the heart is always circulated through a closed network of blood vessels. With each beat, the heart pumps blood into two closed circuits, the systemic circulation and the pulmonary circulation. The two circuits are arranged in series where the output of one becomes the input of other. So first, let us start with systemic circulation. The left side of the heart is the pump for the systemic circulation. It receives bright red oxygen-rich blood from the lungs. The left ventricle pumps blood into the iota. The oxygenated blood entering the iota is carried by systemic arteries to all organs throughout the body except for the air sacs of the lungs which are supplied by the pulmonary circulation. In systemic tissues, arteries give rise to arterioles which finally lead into extensive beds of systemic capillaries. Exchange of nutrients and gases occurs across thin capillary walls. Blood unloads oxygen and picks up carbon dioxide and enters the systemic venue. Venules carry deoxygenated blood away from tissues and merge to form larger systemic veins. Ultimately, the blood flows back to the atrium. This pathway constitutes the systemic circulation. Pulmonary circulation, where pulmon stands for lung. The right side of the heart is a pump for the pulmonary circulation. It receives all the dark red deoxygenated blood returning from the systemic circulation. But here, for your understanding, the deoxygenated blood is represented in blue color. The blood pumped by the right ventricle enters the pulmonary trunk and branches into right and left pulmonary artery. The deoxygenated blood pumped into the pulmonary artery is passed onto the right and left lungs. In pulmonary capillaries, blood unloads carbon dioxide, which is exhaled, and picks up oxygen. The freshly oxygenated blood then flows into pulmonary veins and returns to the left atrium. This pathway constitutes the pulmonary circulation. So thus, this completes double circulation. Thank you for watching. For more videos, please do like and subscribe to my channel.